Hey guys, welcome back to the next video. This time it is the NASTPG1. It's Noctua Thermal Paste Guard for AM5 sockets. I'm going to show you what it does, give you some information, and to see if you want to buy it or not. So make sure you continue to watch. Right, Dan, um, well, this is the NASTPG1. This is an AMD Thermal Paste Guard and cleaning set. So let's take a look at this. I haven't even opened it. Look, now this primarily is to just keep the cpu clean this is all it does doesn't do anything else it's not like the secure frames comes with 10 of these right here so it comes with 10 little clean cloths this is just isopropyl alcohol but obviously of course it's got knocked to branded okay so and that is it this is the secure frame that is it all this does primarily is saves you from the taking off the initial bracket that comes with AM4, uh, AM5, sorry. And all this does is basically it sits there and that's all it does. It just keeps the thermal paste off the transistors that are down in these gaps that this is what it actually does. So let's get this installed and see what it actually does. Okay, so this is my AM5 platform. This is a Ryzen 9 7900 and this is the actual thing. Now, yes, it is plastic, but you could scan that for the manual. But what you essentially do is you take it out of this little slot like this. Put that away. And this is what it is. As you can see, yeah, I got thermal paste all over me, sorry. But as you can see, it's just a clear plastic film that you essentially put on your CPU. So it goes on like that. There we go. And it's in. So, you know, the reason for this type of uh, product is because you got secure frames out that are for AM5. They don't generally make any difference in terms of cooling performance. So the generally not worth buying unless of course you like the aesthetics what this essentially does is it neglects that part of what you want it just neglects the secure frame altogether and it's just a plastic film you put down before you put your cool your cooler down and this is what it does it stops the cpu thermal paste from going into these little edges where these little transistors which are very fragile and you want to be careful of actually hurting them now some thermal pastes are non-conductive but then you can buy ones that are very conductive so if you take your cooler and you place it down like this what it does is it stops the cpu thermal paste from spreading over this over here that's what it essentially does okay and so i bet you were thinking so you made a video about that but this is actually very useful because this just neglects the use of a secure frame, which a lot of brands have been bringing out. The original per, uh, original brand to actually bring out a secure frame was Thermal Grizzly. They got their own secure frame, then Thermal Right. A lot of different brands do it, but the problem is with the secure frames is you have to remove the original stock retention, which you can damage the pins in the socket, or you could initially drop your CPU. So that does cause for some issue because you can damage your new parts by just removing that stock retention so this is where something like this where yeah it's only a bit of plastic but it would stop it and if you've got any worries about this actually like melting or anything it's actually made out of a very resilient plastic and they've tested it themselves this can this can cope under the cpus you've got Noctua, they're a very good, reputable brand out there. They know what they're doing when it comes to the CPU cooler market, like they do with their coolers. And I honestly think, for the same price of a secure frame, which this is about eight quid, it's actually not bad considering. Yes, it only comes with one of these, but these are reusable. You can clean them. And then, of course, it comes with 10 of these, then, which are alcohol wipes. It's isopropyl alcohol, but they're in a wipe. And I know quite a few 
YouTubers, Andy Rafael from eTechnics, personally, I know that he uses these because they're a lot easier than using a paper towel with some isopropyl alcohol, which, to be fair, I actually understand why these are more usable. Now, I will be using these for my future cleaning, so, yeah, but look, it comes with all what you need, it comes with cleaning uh, wipes, and obviously it comes with that little plastic thing. I think for the £8 it costs, I think it's actually worth it. You don't have to remove the stock retention, which is one of those daunting things when it comes to doing any custom or doing a secure frame, because you have to remove it, and there's always a danger you could drop something or damage something. So... I'd like to thank Noctua for sending this out. It's actually a quite interesting product. I was actually quite uh, intrigued to actually have a look of it because it's just plastic, but they've rated it very highly. So, yeah. Don't forget to subscribe. I've got a Noctua air cooler coming out this week coming up, so that'll be for next week. I've also got a case to unbox, and I've got loads of stuff coming for future videos. So make sure you subscribe. So, yeah, make sure you don't forget forget to subscribe this is richard from welsh step i hope you guys have a fantastic weekend and week ahead of you good bye <laughs>